Testing, testing, one, two. Are we on? Is this thing on? And 52 videos in, and uh, we finally mic'd up. Hey, how you guys doing? I'm uh, Weapon X Fitness. This is my channel. Uh, you know, I'm real excited to be able to finally talk to you guys. So uh, yeah, uh, be no more of those uh, funny little silent videos. All right, so today I wanna talk to you about five tips, five tips for healthy eating while traveling. You know, figuring out how to stick to your nutrition plan while traveling, don't worry. Just like in your normal life, uh, you're in control of what you put into your body. So traveling does not mean you automatically eat like crap. You know, that only happens if you're unprepared, uneducated, um, on good options, or choose to do so. You know, my goal with this vlog is to give you um, tips to help you overcome uh, the first two reasons. So your first tip is to set yourself up for success. You know, make sure you're stopping at places with uh, good food options. Um, you know, random hole in the wall, gas stations, convenience stores. Those are good examples of places that are gonna be lacking the quality options that you're gonna be looking for. Uh, try to find healthier restaurants, uh, stores, or even grocery stores to pop in to uh, for a quick bite, you know, snack refill, whatever the case may be. Uh, when it comes to going out, you know, eat once at your destination or you know you can look up at the menu uh, ahead of time to get an idea of you know what you are going to order and then plan accordingly okay and tip number two uh, stick to your schedule uh, you know stick to a plan that you're used to uh, so that hunger cues can't be thrown off if you're someone who you know normally eats smaller meals during the day you know do your best to maintain that um, you know, this makes it easier to stick to your uh, normal portions and, you know, not uh, overeat um, uh, once you get to uh, where you're headed. And, uh, you know, we've all experienced uh, what happens when we come home after a long day and we haven't eaten much. And, you know, our eyes get bigger than our stomach and we literally eat everything in sight. Or, you know, we eat half of everything in sight, stomach's full. A lot of food left over and now we're just sitting there like uh or you know we overeat and our you know stomach is all extra just you know out there and now you're just like uh why did i do that you know so we want to make sure we're making uh you know better choices while we're out there on the road tip number three um focus on protein you know eating adequate amounts of protein is something uh, many people struggle with on a normal day and traveling can make this an even bigger challenge uh, while it can be more challenging to find good food, complete protein sources, planning ahead can make all the difference. Uh, you can find carbs and fats almost anywhere, but high quality protein, it's a bit more difficult to track down or at least cost effective high quality protein. Uh, you can bring along your tub of protein or at least grab protein bars uh, while you're on the go. S tip number four, snacks. <laughs> make sure you plan ahead and have healthy snacks uh, with you that will help to make it easier to make healthy choices. Uh, quality protein based snacks are hard to come by unless uh, you prepare ahead of time. We want to make sure we stay away from, um, you know, the trans fats, all the, the chips, the sodas, the cookies, you know, we want to, you know, any just sugar in general. We want to make sure that, you know, you want to look up places that may have, uh, you know, like a vegan protein cookies or regular protein cookies. Uh, protein bars, um, you know, that are, you know, GMO free or non-GMO gluten free, um, high in protein, high in fiber, uh, certain things like that, you know, or even uh, pre-made protein shakes that usually come in about 12, 15 grams, sometimes 30 or 40. Uh, I go for the 30 or 40 uh, because, you know, I, I require just a little bit more protein in my diet. And tip number five, drink more water. <laughs> You know, I get it, you're traveling. No one wants to stop every 22 minutes to have to frequently use the restroom. Uh, but when you're dehydrated, your hunger cravings will go up. So staying moderately hydrated, you know, a sip here, a sip there, uh, you're helping to eliminate those cravings, uh, which can make it easier to stick to your plan. Uh, you'll avoid um, being fatigued as well from travel and maintain a higher energy level uh, while reaching your destination. Remember, you're in control of what you put in your body. With a little planning and the five tips, you can easily travel and not ruin your diet. Plan ahead and enjoy your trip. This has been Weapon X, signing off.